Tanning hides is something that I've always wanted to master. Tanning is an art. In the past, I have tanned a few rabbit hides and some ground squirrel hides, but never something so large as a cow hide. If you plan to tan hides, then I do not recommend that you start with the cow hide. It is labor intense. When a cow hide is wet, it becomes extremely heavy and is hard to work with. I probably spent at least 20 hours to complete this cow hide, and it took days upon days to actually finish it. I started to even dream about the cow hide at night. I had nightmares that I started flushing the hair side of the hide and had ruined it. There are many different ways to tan and cow hide. My advice is to look at the different ways and then find one that you want to do and stick with it. Since we live in the country, many of our neighbors raise cows for meat. We were gifted with this cow hide. The first step is to flush the cow hide. Every hide will have some extra fat or flesh on it. You'll want to flush as much as possible here. After you flush the cow hide, you want to salt the hide. I use plywood and laid the hide first side down. You want to cover it entirely with Morton salt. You will need a lot of salt here. Now you have to leave the cow hide alone for up to two weeks while it cures. After two weeks, you will want to scrape off all the salt, then start scraping all of the leftover fat and meat. I use my thumb and index finger to pull the fat and meat. My fingers are so sore. Once you've completely done, you want to cover the cow hide with egg yolk. You will need a lot of egg yolk. Massage the egg yolk into the cow hide. Cover the cow hide with wet towels, but not drenched towels. Leave the wet towels on for two days. After two days, wash the cow hide. Any shampoo will do. You will want to use the whole entire bottle. Hang the cow hide on the fence or clothesline to allow it to drain. My husband created a wooden stretcher for me. I pulled the cow hide gently and made some holes in the hide so that I could put yarn through it. Apply some oil to the skin side of the hide. When it is still drying, I use wooden stick, sandpaper, wire brush, and my hands to truss, stretch the cowhide. When the leather is dry, it will be white. You'll want to work with your hands 